good morning student uh, so today as i am going to um, teach you about uh, how you uh, will going to import uh, how you will going to work with a python uh, panda and in this uh, particular python panda today i will going to show you dictionary data frame import and series import how you can import the series how you can import the uh, dictionary data frame okay uh, so uh, this is the import of the uh, series uh, this is the import of the data frame that we can find uh, that um, we will uh, going to work on it that we find that we will going to make it uh, how we uh, can do this and how we can work on it let us see it now see in this uh, program creating a data frame using a dictionary that we have done earlier also uh, so just a, a revision uh, or recap we can say that we i am giving to you uh, what i have done it here i have uh, called here uh, pandas as pd so as uh, i have called here the uh, pandas as pd um, uh, what i am doing i am importing uh, this uh, particular pandas as pd okay uh, then book details so as we find um, that we have a book detail uh, uh, there uh, we have see authors authors um, the name of different authors has been given uh, then a book uh, this is how many books uh, they has done uh, then country in which country foreign country name has been given and uh, type of books um, they uh, has written isn't it so uh, this is one uh, you see it uh, that they are been within uh, one uh, calling braces and uh, within this uh, particular calling braces so uh, this is uh, what we can find it that uh, we are having it uh, within this uh, particular calling braces and as we are using them in this uh, particular calling braces then what we can find that um, df1 equals to uh, pd dot data frame pd dot data frame um, what uh, <coughs> book details so uh, those the book details that means uh, this book details i have called here print df so uh, this is what we have done here this is what uh, we can find it um, that uh, we can uh, find those structures and uh, we can uh, use uh, those uh, structures so as we can find those structures and uh, we can use those structures uh, to be implemented and um, this the particular pattern or structures how we have given so import uh, the particular uh, pattern import uh, the particular uh, structure uh, that uh, we are uh, working uh, with and we are um, making uh, this uh, particular pattern and uh, we are constructing this particular pattern okay uh, so uh, those the particular pattern that uh, we have constructed uh, so uh, what we have that uh, book details book details and those the book details what we find first we have given an author after we have given the author um, uh, then uh, those the uh, names of the different names has been given after we have given those uh, different names then you see books uh, dif uh, different number of books suppose uh, they has written now from which country they are writing from those the different countries which they are belonging from those the countries name we have given and as we have uh, given um, those uh, the particular um, uh, structures as we uh, find it uh, those uh, particular pattern or structures so uh, these uh, the particular structures that we have um, uh, this we uh, find it uh, that uh, we are uh, using and uh, we are making then i have given here the type okay so <clears throat> this is uh, what we can find it uh, that uh, each and every uh, type that we have each and every pattern that we have uh, so uh, those the pattern uh, that we are uh, using that uh, we are making it and uh, we are implementing it so one series see within a bracket open and uh, bracket close the thing has been given and uh, based on this particular thing we have made it so uh, <coughs> df dot equals to pd dot uh, data frame uh, the book details uh, is given there uh, now when we have given uh, the book details now we have to see that uh, that uh, how this uh, particular um, book details is working how we can uh, make uh, uh, them uh, to be workable that means we know we are constructing here what a data frame isn't it data frame of what uh, the book details those the values uh, what we uh, have what we can find it uh, that each of the uh, values uh, that uh, we are happy and 
we are um, concentrating and we are uh, making this uh, particular um, uh, structures and each of these uh, particular structures that we have uh, that we maintain and that we are working with um, uh, we uh, find it those structures is there let us see the output of it now uh, now see the output what we can see in this particular output that you can see here uh, that uh, there are the different structures there are the different pattern uh, that uh, we are uh, constructing and uh, we are using uh, see here uh, those the data frame has been created as you can see uh, that's uh, this uh, particular data frame uh, that uh, we have here uh, we are uh, constructing those uh, data frame and in this uh, particular data frame that uh, we have uh, that we do maintain okay uh, that we do maintain that we uh, do work with and um, uh, there uh, we have the structures and we are using those uh, particular uh, pattern or using those uh, particular structure okay so this is the data frame that we are having uh, this is the uh, data frame that we are uh, constructing so as we are uh, constructing those uh, data frame Uh, as as we are uh, constructing those data frame uh, those uh, particular data frame how you see the indexing has been done by itself it is a self indexing uh, that is done by python and uh, there the values has been arranged um, uh, there are four columns and four columns have the values and uh, this is where we can see how the values are been arranged there and been implemented there okay uh, so this is how we can find it this is how we can see it um, that uh, we have uh, this particular structures and you can see there has been changed the place change we know it due to the size and uh, size uh, implementation of the uh, page what is there the page has been changed and, and they are been uh, working so isn't it so this is how uh, we are working with this particular structures and we are making these structures uh, to be implementable okay now let us see the next program so now see the next one in this next program what you can see that uh, we are using one series series method one i will show you then series method two see here uh, import pandas as pd so uh, name i have given here name is dark rat cat snake after that see here name equals to pd dot series uh, the name has been given and uh, then i have taken the number um, uh, some numbers has been given the num equals to pd dot series num okay then type what i have given the birds uh, mam Mills, domestic and reptiles then what i have given here types equals to pd dot series types then i have given here df1 uh, equals to pd dot data frame uh, animal uh, the name numbers uh, the name uh, type uh, then type so um, uh, this is what uh, the data frame will be constructed that means i have taken here uh, the different sections i have uh, declared the different series okay those are the different series this way also we can create and uh, we can import uh, the particular thing and we can create the particular values okay so as we uh, create those particular values as we work on those particular values this is how we can create the data frame so when we can create the data frame in this way in this particular structure um, what we can find what we can see that we are having those uh, data structures and uh, we are making those data structures in a particular way or particular pattern so as we are making those data structures in a particular way or a particular pattern uh, we can find it we can see it uh, that uh, when we are uh, constructing those data when we are having uh, those uh, particular pattern of data so each of this uh, particular pattern of data um, <coughs> so um, uh, there what we can find uh, that uh, we have uh, this uh, particular uh, structural form and uh, when we are having this uh, particular pattern or structural form uh, we uh, do construct it and uh, we uh, do uh, work on this uh, particular uh, structural area okay so uh, this is what the structural area that we have that means first what we have taken the name name of some animals okay uh, in a particular series okay then what we have taken name uh, what we said uh, that this is a list value this list value how we have done it that uh, um, name uh, equals to pd dot series see here everything we here we have done with a panda 
okay pd dot series that means we have called here a pd dot series pd dot series what pd dot series names uh, that has been called here so after we called here pd dot series names uh, then what we can find num num equals to what some number has been given uh, then what we have given uh, num equals to pd dot series num so as we have find this as we have seen this uh, this uh, particular sections we have done then we can find here the type type what uh, the birds um, mammals uh, domestics and reptiles so uh, this is also one thing that we have done it here so when we have done this particular thing now i am converting it into what into a series how that type equals to pd dot series that means in types only i am doing okay in num only i am doing in a name only i am doing what i am doing pd dot series s e r i e s series not only series if you write series that is wrong instruction pd dot series series then bracket open then uh, the particular element uh, or particular variable which you need to change so here at first i have given the name that means i need to change the name second i have given the num that means i need to change the num third i have given the type so i need to change the type so uh, df equals to pd uh, dot data frame animal is what a uh, name numbers is what num and types is what types so uh, this is how we have uh, done it and we have implemented it then what we have done here uh, see um, print df now i want to print the value of df what will be the value of df that will going to be printed there so <clears throat> when we are uh, printing it when we are uh, making the particular thing uh, to be printed uh, this uh, the printing options uh, that we have this is the printing part uh, that we are implementing and uh, we are uh, working with uh, we can find it uh, those the data pattern those the data structures that we have those the data uh, work uh, that we are uh, making and we are working on it uh, we can make those data structures and we can work on this particular uh, data pattern or data structures okay so as we are working on this uh, particular data pattern on data structures uh, we can see it we can find it and uh, that we will going to have uh, the structures and uh, we are um, working on this uh, particular pattern on particular structures so uh, those the particular pattern or uh, particular structures that we have those the particular uh, pattern or particular structures that we can implement so each of uh, this implementation each of this uh, part of the implementation you know, what we do we are going to find it uh, we see it and that they are being implemented in this way they are being made in this particular pattern okay so uh, what we have done now we have done it see df1 equals to pd dot data frame that means we are uh, converting it into a data frame uh, what data frame uh, with the help of a panda library function uh, with the help of this panda library function we are converting it into a data frame what the data frame uh, animals uh, is names and uh, number is nums and type is types so um, uh, those are the things uh, that we find those are the part uh, that we find uh, that uh, we have uh, this uh, pattern of uh, structure conversion uh, we have uh, this uh, type of data conversion so as we are converting it as we uh, find it uh, that uh, we are using those structures we are uh, making those structures so each of this uh, particular structure or each of this pattern of the structures what we have uh, what we are implementing uh, we find it uh, they are being implemented and they are being organized in uh, a particular format they are being organized in a particular type so uh, those the organizations those the pattern that we have those the uh, particular pattern of organizations that we are implementing let us see the output of it how we will going to get the output of it now see here uh, this the particular uh, output what we can see in this uh, particular pattern of output what we can find in this uh, particular pattern of output here we can see here that uh, there is a uh, values uh, that we have uh, like uh, under the animals uh, the duck came under the uh, name the numbers the number is there type uh, there we have a bird mammal lep, reptiles all these things are there so uh, this is the thing what we can see this is the part uh, that we can see uh, that uh, we have this uh, particular 
particular structures and uh, we are uh, working on this uh, particular structure so as we are uh, working on this particular structures as we are having this uh, particular pattern on structures uh, we can uh, see it and we can find it that we will going to have this particular value and uh, those the values are going to be implemented in this way so in this implementation in this data pattern of implementation that we have uh, that we find that uh, those the implementation of the data those the particular implementation of the data how we have converted uh, it into a series and then we have converted into a data frame okay so uh, now let us see the next program what is there now uh, see here in this uh, particular section uh, what we have this is the second way or second method that we uh, I have implemented here what I have done here import pandas as pd as I have imported the panda as pd then I have given the name name of some animals uh, has been given here then what I have given here name equals to so uh, this pattern of program may come uh, in your exam so uh, next what I have given here uh, that see name equals to pd dot series that means I am calling the panda under the panda i have calling the series uh, serieses okay serieses functions under the serieses function what to be converted into series the name to be converted into a series so that has been given next what we can find uh, num equals to some numbers have been given there and uh, those the numbers what is uh, what we find num equals to pd dot serieses uh, there we can see uh, um, bracket uh, has been opened and <clears throat> there we have given the uh, num and uh, next what we can find uh, type so in the type what we can find uh, that uh, there are the name of uh, the birds mammal domestic reptiles all these things has been given and after that what we have done it we are uh, i have done it here types equals to pd dot series as types so uh, those are the things that first i have uh, taken the values in a list item or in, in an array we can say in an array form of an <coughs> pattern and uh, when we have taken them in a list or an array form of a pattern then uh, what we have done it uh, we have converted them into a series okay because if you are not converting into a series then how we will going to uh, compile them and how we are going to work on it so after converting it from a series then you see i have taken one variable variable name i have given animals so uh, this is the particular variable i have taken here what i have done it uh, that animals uh, is uh, the names number is a num and type is a type so uh, those the uh, headings that we are giving and under them i am uh, denoting those uh, things i am under that I am denoting those particular structures okay so after I have denoted those structures then you see it that df uh, equals to pd dot data frame that means I am calling here the data frame <coughs> so when I am calling here the data frame what I have done it here animals okay so as we find it animals is there so print uh, df1 so this particular df1 we have printed it here and uh, when we have printed those uh, df1 uh, is here there we can find it that uh, we are implementing it and we are working on it okay we are making this particular structures to be implementable now uh, how we will going to see it let us see the output of it now you see uh, the output you see the previous output and this output there is no difference in between them the output remain the same only the structural implementation that means program structure has been changed so when we have changed only the program structure we didn't change the output system output we remain uh, leave it as a same as it is but a little bit of change in the program we have done so uh, this is uh, also the way this is the second way that we can implement it uh, we can do it without uh, uh, changing the output that means our output will remain the same in both the cases both the cases it will make a data frame of the series uh, those the series we have converted and after the list that we have converted into a series is that uh, we have compiled them and uh, as we compile them uh, we have uh, find out uh, uh, the particular output what is there so this is what the output that we find uh, that uh, we are uh, working with and that we are implemented with okay so this the implementation this is the work um, that we find it here that we uh, see it that we are implementing it here uh, we uh, can work with this particular structure and uh, we can find here uh, that uh, <coughs> we have given or uh, we have uh, those uh, particular pattern or our structures okay so each of these particular structures that we are having each of this particular pattern that we are having we can implement and we can do it okay uh, then today i am ending my today's session here